So whether a gun is purchased legally or not, we know that it can end up mm -hmm. in the wrong hands. Sometimes they end up in the hands of children, especially if they are not stored safely. Yeah, and many kids, other kids, many times other kids are the ones that are the victims. Kids are dying from guns in North Carolina more than any other cause. And that's why there's a big push across the state for safe storage, using a gun lock or keeping your gun in a safe. It was the subject of our brand new WRL documentary, Unsafe, which premiered last night. Tonight, WRL investigative documentary reporter Kristen Severance shows us some of the unexpected places where these safe storage conversations are happening. <laughs> Well, we're at Harris Barber College. Harris Barber College, Raleigh, North Carolina. And so it's a judgment-free zone. We definitely want to help you keep your family safe. A new kind of conversation is happening inside a downtown Raleigh institution. So we don't want our children to, to have access to a weapon. And they do. They're fine. They know where things are. We've had two, two instances of uh, three-year-olds who shot themselves uh, fatally by getting their their parents gun. Advocates and law enforcement officials are talking about guns and safe storage to students and customers at Harris Barber College and barbershops across the area. We also know that kids zero to 19, the leading cause of death involves guns, particularly in communities of color. That was really important for us that we engage and we knew a natural spot for that would be the barbershop. Advocates are visiting barbershops with a Wake County Sheriff's deputy who demonstrates how to use a lock. They also hand out free gun locks. It's all part of a statewide push to get people to safely store their guns. These are pretty universal, so they'll fit handguns, shotguns, rifles. What about when people are like, oh, if, if someone breaks in my house and I have the lock on, what, what do you say? We say, obviously, a safe is the best option. I mean, best practices, we want, we want to see people with a safe. People can't afford a safe or if they don't have a place to put a safe. These are a, a cheap alternative. And again, it may not necessarily keep somebody from taking it and carrying away if their house is broken into, but at least it'll keep it out of the hands of children. As we showed you in our documentary, Unsafe, North Carolina kids dying from gun violence. Guns are the leading cause of death among young people. 600 kids have died from guns since 2017. More than 1.7 million homes have guns in North Carolina, and 840,000 of those homes have a firearm that is not safely stored. Customers don't really know the numbers. Reggie Winston owns a barber shop with four locations. And I own the bar, bar shop. It's a pretty cool concept. We have a bar in the barber shop. He said customers want to talk about this. Typically, we hear about the gunshots and the gun violence, but we don't hear about the accidental and the suicides. So when you present those numbers to them and explain how it affects our community so much, uh, they're blown away. And a lot of times the customers want to take it a step further, like, hey, this is good. Thank you all for coming out. But what more can we do? I'm WRL investigative documentary reporter Kristen Severance.